conductor knows the railroad very well. The engineer knows all the curves. He knows it by heart. He knows every bump and turn in it.
Now why does that happen? Anybody know why that happened? No. Okay, tell me. Somebody tell me. They pushed the brakes too hard. No, he didn't push the brakes too hard. Oh, yeah. When the train stopped, the, this car rolled back and hit that one. That car rolled back. The couplers actually have slack in them. There's about a foot's worth of slack in the couplers between the cars, so that when you couple the cars up, they don't jam up against each other and hurt them. There's some slack in them. So when the engineer stops the train and brakes don't come out instantly, it rides, rolls back again. I told you you can't get on the moving train, so once it stops, you can climb on. He's a brakeman. He was stopping traffic for us, right? Making sure there's no traffic coming. So you hear the brakes squeaking just a little bit. It takes a little longer for these brakes to come off.
got it.
Alabama for it. And as we're approaching the station, if that was power, that would be orange, which means it flows slowly. So it's halfway up. If it's straight up, that means the drop is clear. If it's all the way down.